what is comparator comparator as the name implies they are used to compare two voltages when one is higher than the other the comparator circuit output is on one state and when the input conditions are reversed then the comparator output switches these circuit find many uses as detectors they are often used to sense voltages for example they could have a reference voltage on one input and a voltage that is being detected on another while the detector voltage is above the reference the output of the comparator will be in one state if the detected voltage falls below the reference then it will change the state of the comparator and this could be used to flag the condition in operation the op amp goes into positive or negative saturation depending upon the input voltages as the gain of the operational amplifier will generally exceed 1 lakh the input will run into saturation when the inputs are only fraction of a millivolt apart comparator circuit although op amps are widely used as comparator special comparator chips are often used these integrated circuits offer very fast switching times well above those offered by most op amps that are intended for most linear applications typical slew rates in the region of several thousand volts per microsecond although more often figures of propagation delay are quoted a typical comparator circuit have one of the inputs held at given voltage this may often be potential divider for a supply or reference source the other output is taken to the point to be sensed within the circuit the resistors are one and r2 from a potential divider between the two voltage rails the voltage at the junction of the two resistors is a switching voltage for the circuit ensure differential input not exceeded as there is no feedback the two inputs to the circuit will be at different voltages accordingly it is necessary to ensure that the maximum differential input is not exceeded input current change as a result of the lack of feedback the load will change particularly as the circuit changes there will be a small increase in the input current for most circuits this will not be a problem but if the source impedance is high it may lead to a fewer unusual responses input signal noise the main problem with the circuit is that the new the change of a point even small amount of noise will cause the output to switch back and forth thus near the change of a point there may be several transitions at the output and this may give rise to problems elsewhere in the overall circuit use of a comparator chip comparator chips are much better at handling switching between two values and may often have output stages that can more easily interface with logic than analog operational amplifiers as they employ this form of output it means that it is very easy for them to interface with logic circuitry